Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for November the 15th of 2020. Well, it is titled Edge on Galaxy NGC 5866. So what do we see here? Well, this is an example of a spiral galaxy that we are seeing from the edge. And what does that mean? That means that it is tilted. So we are seeing the very thin portion of it and not seeing it directly. So we don't see it uh, face on and see the spiral structure as we often see in a spiral galaxy. But we see it through the edge and it gives you a good idea of just how these galaxies are composed. And we can see that a lot of the material that gas and the dust is confined to a very narrow disk. So it's extremely thin. And when we look at it edge on it, not quite, but it comes close to disappearing. And then we can see some of the halo of the galaxy scattered around it flattened down, but not uh, not all the way concentrated down as much as the disk material is. So it gives us an idea of the structures of these galaxies. And one of the ways we can learn about galaxies and spiral galaxies in particular, is to look at a whole bunch of different ones. And that's because we see them from different perspectives like this. We can't travel around a spiral galaxy. This one happens to be over 40 million light years away and look at it from all angles to see what it looks like. So we have to look at lots of different galaxies and that helps us put together a picture overall of what the spiral galaxies are like. So it's a way to learn about things when you can't actually go out there and gather them or collect them or hold them in your hands when you have objects like this which are much much too large to be able to do that and much too distant to be able to do this. So again, no way to travel out that great distance to be able to study this galaxy directly. However, we can make measurements of it and learn about the galaxy. And in fact, it is a, a galaxy about the around the size of our Milky Way, about a little bit smaller. So about 60,000 light years across as compared to about 100,000 for our own Milky Way. We can also see some of the differences in the colors. If we look at the disk and how it extends out beyond the dust, we see that it has a bluish color to it. Whereas the halo around in the central portions around the center tend to be a little more yellow or even reddish, telling us about the different populations of stars that have formed there very young stars in the disk and older stars in the halo and near the bulge near the center of the galaxy. So we get to see this galaxy edge on uh, an edge on version of a galaxy today. So that was our picture of the day for November the 15th of 2020. It was titled Edge on Galaxy NGC 5866. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be Grecian skyscape. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone. And I will see you in class.